what do you believe is driving this market? Yes, we're seeing weakness this morning, but this bull market has been in place and continues. Do you see this continuing in the future in the, for the coming months? Um, I absolutely do. I mean, it just comes down to, again, the amount of money is just astronomical that's out there right now, Maria, and it's only going to get to be, it's like we're going to have more rocket fuel upon rocket fuel as we get this other $1.9 trillion worth of stimulus. It just gets mind-blowing. We've talked about this a lot, what the end of the year is going to look like, with, you know, consumers are saving like 20% of their savings. They got like $1.9 trillion sitting right now in savings. And literally, there's so much stuff we're going to spend money on once we see the economy reopen. Now, I think the important thing here, though, is what you have to start to realize, no matter what a Reddit trader tells you, profits are going to be really important. You know, we're going to see the reacceleration of the profit cycle. You know, the business cycle has not been repealed. And I think you know, what you have to be careful about here is where you're putting your money. Because the one thing we've seen over the last six months, and I call this on your show, is big tech is starting to tap out. You know, their earnings were so big last year, it's going to be so hard to improve on that. Like, if you're Amazon and you did $20 billion in profits last year, it's going to be hard to go to $40 billion in profits. Whereas if you start looking into, I've talked about this on your show a lot, things like energy, financials, consumer discretionary, right? We're going to go out and eat a lot. We're going to go to hotels. All those trends are going to be huge because, like, all those companies right now have been bringing their, their costs down a lot because they were hurting last year. And now they're going to see a huge boom in their profits. So eventually that's yeah. where money's going to go to. And that's where you've got to have your cash right now. And I think it's a big mistake not to. Well, you, you mentioned all this money thrown in the economy. We're talking about a total of six COVID-19 bills uh, to address this COVID uh, disaster, equaling 25 percent of GDP. So this $1.9 trillion takes us all the way above $5 trillion 25 percent of GDP. Yeah, that's a whole lot of stimulus for sure. And markets have reacted.